I can't go out. <laughs> I'm sick. I'm really sick, actually. I have a head cold. Not to worry. It's just a head cold. You got me. I've been hit. I really didn't want to film a video today because, obviously, this is why creators batch create. Because if something happens, they have something to post. I don't have anything to post, so I've just been chilling and cruising. I just wanted to make sure you guys didn't miss a video. I just thought it would be really fun to share with you, like, a sick routine. I'm not a health professional. I don't know everything, but these are just some remedies that I picked up along the way that have really helped me and that I feel really good about. So I wanted to share it with you, kind of show you, break down my little routine of getting better. To start, I have some bone broth. This is organic bone broth. Bone broth is just awesome for you. There's so many health benefits. Look it up on the Google and you'll see what I'm talking about. No, you can't have this. This is not for you. What are you doing? Okay. <laughs> you see the camera now? <laughs> I'm gonna just keep sipping my bone broth. Um, I really need to get back to sleep, but I have some other stuff that I'm gonna show you what, what I take and then, um... You're not gonna get this. This is not for you right now. Tip number one of the routine. Sleep. Not watch TV, not be on your phone. Not doing work like I'm doing right now, but sleep, like literally sleep. Goodbye. I'm so tired. Okay, let me do this really quick. Tip number two, keep clean. You already know what it is. Keep yourself and your area clean. I know when we're sick, sometimes it's just hard to like even want to move. If you're not to the point where you're like dead asleep and you still have some kind of energy, then just... Take care of yourself. So I like to wash my face because I like to feel clean. Niacinamide and zinc from The Ordinary. Trusty bio oil, you know it. Manage. The difference you feel when you just clean yourself, the difference. Tip number three, drink lots of water. That's a given, everyone knows that, but Sometimes it's really hard to do when you're sick. Like the last thing you want to do is drink more water. I suggest to get a cup that has encouraging words on the bottles to motivate you. Sometimes it works. I've lost my strength. Theo, I wish you had thumbs. We shall prevail. I was just in a I was just in a in a in a struggle with this water bottle. I can't open it. Thank you, babe. It was so easy. Anyway, like I was saying, my third tip was water. It's um honey citrus mint tea. That's pretty much what it is. I used to work at Starbucks ages ago and I'm pretty sure they put lemonade in it. It's the only thing that I'm like my heart because when I am sick, I don't like to intake any kind of sugar because sugar feeds viruses. That is like so good for the soul. I think they used to call it medicine ball. I think that's what it was called when I worked at Starbucks. Oh, the liquid. Special tip number four. This will be two in one. If you have a cold, you're gonna wanna get the nice tissue. Invest in the nice tissue because you don't want your nose to be all red and sore after you're done with your cold. So I like to get the Kleenex with soothing lotion. For extra protection, I at night 
once I know that I've been using lots of tissue throughout the day, I'll go ahead and put on some Vaseline on my nose, just in the areas that I know that it usually gets really sensitive. And that usually, I never have a red or raw nose after I get sick now because I know how to take care of my nose. Talking to you guys like you've never been sick before, which I know is not true. And I know you probably have tips and, and different remedies that you enjoy and that have worked well for you. So in the comment section, let me know your best recovery, healing, cold remedies that you have. I want to know them. So maybe I can try them. I'm going to clunk out now and I will catch you back when I wake up. So I literally slept for like four hours four or five hours. The more sleep the better, right? I have my air purifier on, it's a little humming. I woke up and Yannick had preemptively got me food because I was gonna make lunch, but I was out. So it's like almost three o'clock and he got me Panera bread. A safe thing he goes to get for me whenever I'm sick, really, really sweet got me the chicken noodle soup, the turkey bacon bravo, and then just a baguette. I'm really behind. I need to catch up. So John's dream was the, that the king would no. and there would be a regency where my mother would rule. Tip number five. I think we're at five. If you can and you're able, get some sunshine. Getting fresh air really is really helpful, especially when you're not feeling too well. This is where we are with water. I haven't made it to the 3 p.m. mark and it's already four, <laughs> so uh, I'll just drink a little bit more, but this is perfect because I can take my vitamins with the water. Here's the lineup. What's love, got to feel, got to feel What's love? Oh God. <laughs> Doubling up on my vitamin C, I take vitamin C tablets. I have zinc, vitamin D. My special herbal supplement from Sprouts. This is the, let me see if it focuses. Brilliant, honey. Thank you, thank you. Did you know we, I just the set of stairs in? I didn't know, but it's exciting. I gotta go up the stairs. never bored the immune rescue uh, pills from sprouts herbal supplements they're amazing i actually usually will take them every day because they're really really good and then i also take these herbal supplements and these are olive leaf i've got some oils that i'm actually gonna put on myself this one's an organic oil it's from sprouts eucalyptus essential blend and it's a roll-on i usually will have some oils from uh doTERRA or young living but i've kind of been trying outside of that for some time because I've read some things online that I'm not too happy about and I've been trying to distance myself from MLM companies as a whole after my experience with Monat. It just put a sour taste in my mouth when it comes to MLMs. So no offense, please don't take that offensively. I just have to try out other things. So far this is working. I will say that I do miss um, how strong the oils from both doTERRA and Young Living are. <laughs> It's not dra dramatized, that's just how I sneeze. <laughs> oh, okay, I think we need to go lay outside. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm obsessed. This Look at the cute little rug. Great choice. It's yeah? So good. This came so quick. I got it from Wayfair, this set. I've always had really good experiences with Wayfair. I just have to be really selective, but overall really good experiences. To me, I love how these pieces turned out. They're super good quality. And I love the cute rug that's gonna straighten out over time. I'm incredibly happy with 
how that patio set came out. So right now, I'm actually gonna cook some dinner. I feel well enough to cook dinner, but I think that that's probably the last task that I'm gonna do for the entire day because I'm starting to get the fatigue again. I have this um, organic Mediterranean style salad kit from Trader Joe's, which is actually pretty fire. And it's super easy to make because you just put it in the bowl. And that's why we're calling it a lazy girl salad. Okay, so this is what we've got so far. It looks so delicious. I'm gonna add um, my favorite Trader Joe's Green Goddess seasoning to the salad. No meat today. You could add shredded chicken, but frankly, I'm not in the mood for meat today. Just some salt and pepper. I'm actually also gonna add a red onion too because last minute I just thought about it. Eat your Tip number six, eat your vegetables and just try to eat as healthy as you can while you're under the weather. When our moms would force us to eat chicken noodle soup and stuff, like they were onto something because this is how you're gonna feel better faster. One more kiss and I'll be gone. Taste test. It's delicious. You you What's the crunchiness in there? Remember my favorite, my red pepper. This will get me to eat salad. A lot of salad. Big little moves. But look at the pantry. The pantry doesn't look too bad, huh? Those pumpkin seeds add a really good crunch along with the red peppers and the red onion. It's a new day. Good morning. So last night I pretty much passed out after I had my salad and I slept really really good i feel better this morning in the sense that i don't have that scratchy annoying almost sore throat um right now it's just mainly congestion uh i feel like more energetic my body doesn't feel as like achy and gross i feel like ready to do things but i know i need to take it easy because this is only day two um, i'm drinking my bone broth this morning and i'm actually going to put on a chest rub it's not VIX, it's actually so much better for you than VIX. I got it at Sprouts. It is literally just, the ingredients are olive oil, eucalyptus, clove oil, wintergreen oil, and vitamin E oil. That's all that's in here. I honestly feel like after today, if I take it easy and if I rest, I'll be 100% by tomorrow. I got my strength back. Woohoo! Why is it spicy? The hash browns are from Trader Joe's. I don't know if you guys have seen them on TikTok and stuff, but I love them. They're super delicious and crispy, especially when you cook them in the air fryer. So I pop them in the air fryer for about five minutes. And then as you could see, I've got avocado, red onion, and then a sunny side up egg on top. That's it. And it's delicious. Doesn't even need like additional seasoning. I do put the truffle, um, the truffle mayonnaise, just a light layer on it because I like that spicy truffle mayonnaise. It's really good. I had Yannick pick me some oranges off of our tree. It was the last of them. So I decided to make the orange juice. It's so sweet i hate orange juice in stores i hate it i hate it i can't drink orange juice i'm too bougie i guess i think i'm gonna end the vlog here i hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me while i was sick it sounds so ridiculous when i say it out loud thank you guys so much for watching i look forward to seeing you in the next video when i'm a lot better Why do I feel like a basal raptor?
Babe, is it called a Vasalaraptor? My brain is not working. That's adorable. No, it's not. My head's cold. My head's cold. <laughs>